a recent trend that I've started to seeing everywhere on the internet, especially on Tumblr, <laughs> is the so-called glitter eyebrows. I'm not really the type of person who usually tries to follow trends a lot, like baking. What on earth is baking? Mm. But glitter eyebrows sounds like the best idea ever. I love glitter and therefore I thought that I could try this out. And this is not a tutorial at all because I don't know how to do this. I've never done it before and I'm not some kind of makeup artist. Obviously I'm 15, I'm not a makeup artist. Let's try and do this together. I'm using a glitter eyeliner because I've seen a few people do these kind of glittery eyebrows where they are using eyelash glue and then cosmetic glitter. But that seems really hard to take off. You shouldn't use eyelash glue in your eyebrows or in your hair that isn't your eyelashes. <laughs> but we're going to use a glittery eyeliner instead. A liquid glittery one that still has the price tag on. But since my eyeliner is turquoise or like blue, I'm going to use a turquoise eyeshadow to fill in my eyebrows. I'm going to need a mirror because reasons. Okay, this is the pencil that I'm going to use. I don't have a lot of professional makeup brushes so I normally just use the same ones as I use for painting. Look at this. This is awesome and it contains tea so it's great. Back to the tutorial. I just so happen to have a turquoise eyeshadow. And this one, is, this pouch is actually quite great, even though it's cheap and it's probably going to give me cancer. But I'm going to use the turquoise one to fill my eyebrows with. I have not really tried filling in my eyebrows with uh, these kind of colours before. So just try and do this as you normally would apply your eyeshadow, but like turquoise. <laughs> or whatever colour it is that you want to do. You might even want to do like a fading ombre brow. That sounds cool and professional. But since I only had one colored eyeliner at home, we will only be doing one color. Ooh, this would look so great if I actually had turquoise hair as well, which is something I've been thinking about perhaps getting because I seem to obsess over turquoise all the time and then I'm going to do you know the fade thing I don't want it to be as harsh harsh yeah and I think I'm just going to do one eyebrow to start off with <laughs> it's going to look so funny blend this out woohoo looks pretty nice to me I just so happen to have a blue pencil liner I was going to say to give this a more natural look but seriously I'm just going to go ahead and fill this in a little bit, at least at the end here, where I have the least hat. Looks pretty darn good to me. I sound like I'm trying to be happy from my little pony, and it doesn't sound good. Okay. That's actually really nice. I really like how this turned out with the shape and everything. Yeah. Nice. I like the way this eyebrow turned out and like the shape and everything. But it looks so weird when I only have one, not any other makeup, and just my natural colored hair. Like it doesn't look natural. <laughs> but it's not supposed to be natural. It's supposed to be like fun. Okay, this I like. This I like. This I like very much. Mm. Where's the glitter? Glitter! I seem to have lost the glitter. I found it. Okay, so now the glitter eyeliner. Woo! And this has just like a normal applicator. A normal applicator. <laughs> this kind of, like an eyeliner brush thing. Some people who do these kind of glittery eyebrows, they make them really thick. That's what happens when you use the eyelash glue and the cosmetic glitter. If you put um, that on your eyebrows, it'll look really thick and heavy if you don't do it right. And not a lot of people do it right. This is safer, easier to remove and also looks more natural. I'm going to stop praising the glitter eyeliner while well, I'm trying not to get so many clumps and stuff. When this dries it also kind of serves as a eyebrow gel. Kind of, I said. Can okay, never have too much glitter. Think about how you normally do your eyebrows, if you normally do your eyebrows. Like, where do you normally put the most product? Like, for example, I normally put the most product down here and 
like if I want to create an arch because that's for a released high -res. and I feel like you do this you should do the same with the glitter like the most glitter is like here and not here I like the way this turned out and I'm going to go ahead and do the other eyebrow and put on my makeup and then you'll see how it looks okay bye for now okay so this is the final result with all the makeup I kind of managed to do a slightly even winged eyeliner for once and that feels kind of great and it also looks very nice with these eyebrows. Yeah, I really like this look actually. I'm not going to wear it every day because it took me a long time. Bye! Yeah, <laughs> so... <laughs> yeah, so... <laughs> My mirror fell down. <laughs> Life. This piece of shit. What the fuck? Okay. Haha. <laughs> Decor. Sound professional. <laughs> My eyebrows. Life is fucking. Hmm. Jeez. <laughs> This is a rainbow shocker. Yup. It's as scary as it gets. Glitter eyebrows. Bra ah, la, la. Yay. Glitter. La la. Can't speak. Oh, awesome. <laughs>